Hi, good afternoon. This is Peggy at Jingly Dolls again. Um, I want to make a recording today of how to alter patterns. Um, when you get a pattern or you have a pattern that has a bend, like a knee or an elbow, but you want it to your doll or your teddy bear or whatever it is to have a straight leg or a straight arm, what I do is I don't want to destroy my original pattern, so I lay the original pattern on top of a piece of paper. Let's see if I can do this. I'm trying to work around the camera and trace around it. So I can save my original. <clears throat> and then I cut cut the one that I'm gonna alter, cut it out. Oops, I'm not cutting a very straight line here. Let's see if I can get this all in the camera view. My camera's kind of close to the table, but I want you to be able to see what I'm doing. There we go. You always want to straighten the leg or straighten the arm at the knee or at the elbow. So what I do is I just draw a straight line straight across from the back of the knee to the front of the knee or at the elbow from the inside of the elbow to the outside of the elbow and then you cut this pattern now remember you still have your original now the original Let's measure this. The original was, let's see, three and a quarter, about six, six and a half inches from the top of the leg to the bottom of the foot. So that's what we want this one to be. We want this one to be about six or six and a half inches. <clears throat> when I get it straightened out. So I'll we'll put the foot at the bottom. <clears throat> this is the back of the leg. We want it to be pretty straight. Yeah, we put the top of the leg there. Then let's measure that. This is a tape measure I cut up. All right, that's six and a half inches right there. So then, I hang on to both those pieces, trace around it again. You could even tape them together if you're not real sure the first time you do this. After you've done it a few times, you'll become pretty comfortable with it. Trace all the way around it again. Look at there. You have a leg. You got a straight leg with no bend. Now remember, after you get done doing your um, making your new pattern, be sure you take the original notes off of your pattern. Like this one was cut for. You want your stretch to go this way. To stretch your fabric to go that way. And you want to leave the back of the leg open for stuffing. So you want to be sure you put in your original notes on your pattern and then cut it out and you're good to go. Your new creature or dolly or whatever you're going to make has got a straight leg or a straight arm. 
that's how you do it easy peasy all right thanks for coming by today i hope to help you out bye